It is, James. It's uh, it's it's seven weeks of summertime. That's Cheryl. right. And now today we are in Urbana. <laughs> Storm Center 7 Chief Meteorologist Michael Vrydag. She's uh, you, you had a great tease there uh, yeah. going into the last commercial. You, you're about to share, uh, yeah. I, I, I guess, a, f a friendly, fun, furry animal that you've come across. Oh, this furry animal is super cute. It is a one-year-old goat named Joey. So we're going to go ahead and get right to that interview because I know that you guys really want to meet Joey. First and foremost, we have Joey's, what would we call you, mom? Uh, maybe grandma. Maybe grandma. This is your daughter's goat, right? Correct. And uh, Christy, this is Joey. And what makes Joey so unique? Say so Joey has blue eyes, which is uh, very unique to goats. Um, most of them have like a yellowish or brown eye, and he has blue, a crystal blue. <laughs> and while there's lots of food here to eat at the fair, what is Joey eating? Joey loves animal crackers. <laughs> <laughs> now, Joey's a grand champion, correct? What made uh, Joey grand champion? He is the grand champion dairy weather, um, and he was in a class of four. He was actually in the same class with his half-brother and beat his brother, so. Oh. Well, can I feed Joey a, a, a animal cracker? You can. Thanks. Oh, Joey's so sweet. Thank now, you. Now, how long is Joey going to be at the fair for? He will be here until Thursday. He goes home on Thursday, so. Oh, excellent. And Toby is over here having a fit. Yes. This is uh, the half-brother. Hey, Toby, you want something to say? Oh, you were pretty vocal before. I guess he, he's, he's camera shy, but he was pretty loud earlier. Um, so if you want to come down to the Champaign County Fair, it runs through Friday, so you have plenty of time to come meet Joey the goat, the blue-eyed goat, the grand champion, and there are a ton of other farm animals here that you can check out through Friday as well. Now let's get to the forecast. If you want to head out tonight, it is a muggy night. I'll tell you this much. I'm inside the barn and away from the sunshine, whatever is out there, and it's still very muggy. Those dew points are sitting in the upper 60s to low 70s and we know that puts you into that miserable sticky range we will see some relief from that humidity into the next few days as we look at radar we do see that dry weather is uh, throughout the entire county and really most of the miami valley as we do have some drier conditions that are trying to move in the big picture view will show that we have cloudy skies throughout the state there are some showers to our southeast and our southwest but when i'm looking at trends for how long Long, we're going to see dry weather before rain returns. I expect that we're going to go through at least the rest of tonight without any precipitation. By the time we wake up tomorrow morning, though, there will be the chance for some more showers in the forecast. So if you're looking to head to the fair early tomorrow, you might want to bring the umbrella with you. I don't necessarily see the threat for storms. Once we get to lunchtime and into the afternoon and evening, clouds, rain, they're going to move out and we're going to see a lot more sunshine to finish up the day. So here's a look at the hourly forecast for the evening evening. We're going to stay quiet. Temperatures are going to be dropping uh, back through those 70s into the 60s overnight. And then tomorrow's fair forecast, there is that chance for rain early and then we dry out with highs near 80. Still a little bit on the muggy side until we get into the weekend. When we look ahead to the upcoming weekend, you can see that we do have temperatures around the 80 degree range. It will feel comfortable, low humidity. We're dry on Saturday, mostly sunny skies. And then Sunday, we'll start to see a little bit more in the way of cloud cover to return chance of a shower to our west later on Sunday, but really most of the day at this point looks to remain dry. Seven-day forecast does show that chance for showers early tomorrow, and then we go several days without rain. That dry air and comfy conditions are expected to return to our area for most of the next seven days before that chance for rain returns later next week. Now, coming up at 6 o'clock, I'm going to head over to see if the horses are getting ready for the harness race, and also there is a flag dedication to the veterans as tonight is Veterans Night and Senior Night uh, here at the Champaign County Fair. For now, I'm going to send it back to you guys. I'm live here at the Champaign County Fair at Storm Center 7 Chief Meteorologist McCall Friday. All right, McCall, thanks. We love those blue eyes on Joey the Goat. <laughs>